What's up guys? Here he's back. Um got a lot of things to show you in this little scene segment. Whatever you wanna call it. Um but uh had a nice couple days, nice couple weeks actually. Been doing a lot lately. Um uh, been picking up a lot of stuff. A lot figures. I got Warpath in the other day. Um, I picked up uh, for uh, Diego and Fernando Earthquake. Uh, that new Triple H. Yeah, the Four Horsemen box that you've seen and the sting that you see in this, um, this video on the Hulk that you see in this video actually too um that sting is tremendous i like that sting it, i bought two of them just to bought two of them just i wanted to make the nwo wolf pack red sting so i bought two of them made that left one white painted one red uh, this eric bischoff right here is a custom it's a custom off of a uh, what is it? This is it right here. Ruthless Aggression figure. This is what came on it. Um, this is what came in the packaging. But, um, yeah, he came after that, and I popped the head off. And then I was trying to take off the peg. The peg popped off the figure as well as the head. So me and Mom were trying to sit there popping the peg, trying to pop the peg out of his head. So... We finally got it off, and I finally got it onto one of these suited bodies. So, which I am amazed at this. I'm amazed at uh, this Bischoff figure, this Bischoff head. So, I wanted him in a suit. Left him in the suit. I want to get more NWO so I could do more shots like this. With him looking for Hogan with Sting, you know, doing his usual Sting stuff towards Hogan. Wanting the belt, you know, the old WCW days, if you guys know what I'm talking about. Some of you guys know what I'm talking about, some of you guys don't. Um, Bischoff and Hogan always being together and Sting being that chessboard on the piece to play with. He was perfect. Um, I have Scott Hall, but he is in his Razor Ramon outfit, so I gotta find the um, Scott Hall NWO. The Macho Man NWO and uh, Kevin Nash NWO and the Giant. But other than that, those are the three I'm looking for. But I hope I heard they're coming out with Hollywood NWO, Hollywood Hogan NWO soon. And then there's another uh, Macho Man coming out, which I could customize this Macho Man into an NWO Macho Man. So, not so not so hard. And I could custom another Razor Ramon, so it, do, it doesn't really matter. Um, I just hand, I've been taking a lot of pictures. Uh, my shelf looks normal. Warpath is in there somewhere, but I just picked this up today. Uh, that Hell in a Cell thing right there. I took a picture with it. You see it on the page, but uh, yeah, I took a picture with that thing. Um, it said authentic scaled ring. I thought it would meant it was supposed to go with this one right here, this scaled ring right here, but it doesn't. It came with that crappy bungee jump spring ring the one that's tinier than all hell but it works because I'm just going to take pictures with it I'm not going to play with it so I don't play with my figures no more I just set them up put, put, put a picture up do a YouTube video and that's it but uh, other than that let me show you what else let's see what else I got here before let me give me a, let me give me a light real quick You see Warpath. I know the glare. I, I know you see the the, uh, 
the light glare, but there's Warpath. Where my light shining, Warpath. So, I just got him. Um, crossbones, you've seen already. I'm getting close to, to the people I actually do want, you know. People I've been wanting for a while. So, and, uh, this is the... NWO Red Sting right here. The Wolfpack Sting. The one that I customized even the inside of it. The, um, the Scorpion's painted red and his face is painted red. So that Sting is... I like that Sting. Um, you've seen the, the Horseman box set. Uh, there's that Triple H with his mask and all his all his fodder. Um, what else we got here? Oh yeah, the custom boss man. Took him off of a classic superstar classic boss man. So there's a boss man. Looks pretty good to my to my notification. Took a classic boss man, the superstar classic one. And dropped Roman, uh, dropped uh, his head onto a Seth Rollins body and his arms. So I took Rollins' head off and Rollins' arms off and posted his arms and his head. His head's kind of too big for the figure, but it still plays out. So And then Earthquake. And then Fernando and Diego. So, just posted a picture with him. I've been looking for him everywhere. I didn't know. And I finally found him. So, all my wrestlers are here. Been taking a lot of wrestling shots because I've been doing a lot of customs with the wrestlers. Um, especially, that's the Eric Bischoff that the head came off. Yeah, look at, watch, look at this. His head busted completely off the spring. I'll show you a better light. His head busted off completely off the spring. So, I was kind of mad, but other than that, I don't really need this figure. I'd, I would love to use his coat for something, which I will soon, and eventually use his coat for something, but other than that, this figure is a doll figure, so. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. I've been working. I've been working on getting an, another video out. Uh, I finally put the um, Silver Surfer in the casing. The new. I gotta we'll still work on him. The new uh, Dare the Daredevil. Um, yeah, but the casings are still good. I just took everything out and put everything back in the baggies because I didn't want doubles. The Dante, you've seen him, and all the Star Wars and everything. And then all the miscellaneous figures. And then you got some divas up there, and then all the Assassin's Creed figures. Um, and then my wrestlers. But, uh, other than that... Everything else looks pretty dandy, so I will speak to you guys another time in another segment, and I will start doing this more often. Peace.